design tools. They can get a little bit confusing. Some people get mixed up with them. Let's just try and clarify what it's all about. Alrighty, so let's have a look at how we can represent solution designs with some visual tools. So let's scroll down, we'll go past pseudocode. That is definitely a thing, uh, especially if you're doing any programming. But let's have a look at some more visual tools such as sitemaps. So if you're doing a website, um, or an app or something like that, you would show where the main page is and what the links are to various other pages and the sub branches of those or the sub pages of each of those. Fairly simple thing to do. It's just so that you get a sense of how many pages you need and what pages they are. Storyboards, now a little bit like um, our friends over in the media department, storyboards are a common design tool. They have quite a lot of detail and you can have storyboards on a on one part of a solution or you can show the entire solution with a series of storyboards like if you're doing a number of pages on a website you would include a number of storyboards and it has a whole stack of information layout diagrams and mock-ups are fairly much the same sort of thing um, basically they're showing the layout of your page or a layout of your screen So looking at mock-ups as well, there's an example of a mock-up of a spreadsheet. But as you can see, mock-ups will show the layout of things, they'll show what the different colours are, what sort of fonts you're using, the size of your fonts. So all these little annotations or labels are all over the place showing where everything is and what everything does. So that's an important part of any mock-up or layout diagram, pretty much the same thing. So that's it really. There's often a lot of confusion between layout diagrams and mock-up diagrams. You wouldn't do a layout diagram and a mock-up, you would just do one of those. You don't even need fancy software, you can just use pencil and paper, Google Drawings or Google Slides, something that's free and simple, not a problem. Hope that's helpful. Thanks for watching.